was here first. Yeah, I just had to get a few extra things. It's only going to take like five minutes. I didn't cut the line. Listen, listen, if you're going to argue with me, today's not the day. I have a very mild headache. It's there, but it's not, and I don't want to deal. I don't want to fight with any of you. Okay, I am just talking to this cashier lady right here. Yeah, and I'm just going to figure things out. You've already waited like an hour in line. I'm sure you can wait like five, fifty extra minutes. Hi. I'm Jessica, but people tend to call me Karen. They don't really make sense together, but uh, I just take it. Okay, so I I looked in a flyer somewhere. I don't have it on me. Um... I have a dog that likes to just rip things up, so I don't have Ami, um, but I, you guys know the business anyway. And I saw that there was 80% off of all your merchandise here, all your clothes. No? Oh, it definitely is. It literally had a flyer. I got it in the mail, and it said that you guys had your whole entire store 80% off. That was before COVID? Okay, but honey, we're literally still in the pandemic, so I do think you guys should be having that 80% off discount. That doesn't make any sense. I have literally been in quarantine, so I've been at home, and I haven't been having the chance to get that discount yet. So for a woman who has tried to save all your lives, you know, not going out, not breathing on you guys. Where's my mask today? Oh, well, the pandemic's over, so I don't think I need it, right? Sweetie, sweetie, listen, listen, I, like I said, today is not the day to mess with me. I, I have so many lawyers literally backed up on my phone, and I will easily sue this place for you harassing me. do have some more merchandise to pay for and I do ask that you give me that 80% discount. Okay. Well, we'll talk about that after. Excuse me, miss. Miss, put your mask back on. You're breathing on me. I have, literally have five kids to take care of. I don't need a mask. I'm, I, I'm immune to the disease. Alright, so I got these shoes. They're called kids. Now, they said they were $20, but I truly think, you know, you guys don't keep up with your shoes. So there's a stain here, a stain here, a stain here, and these are what, new? They're used. They were in the clearance section. You guys sell used shoes. Do you know we're literally in a pandemic and you're selling shoes? Okay, well, I still want them, but I would like the newer versions. This is all you have? Okay, well, what about sizes? Do you have any extra sizes of these? I'm a size 8. Okay. Um, well, I guess my daughter will have these. Um, but I do suggest you have them for me for like, like 50% off, including the 80% off discount. Um... I don't remember how much they were, but maybe like give me them for like two dollars. That's not a big difference. I I come here to try to relieve my stress, to take off any stress that I have, because people lately have just blew my mind. And I am talking to you, person to person, female to female, whoever you are, and I just trust you that you will be able to meet my needs. And those shoes had so many stains on them. So I do suggest you give me a 50% off on top of the 80% off discount. Fine, fine, fine. Then I, I, then I am not getting these. Um, and I will be sure to let all my other friends that I have at my book club know how awful you are at customer service. I still have more stuff. Let me buy this stuff and I can get out of your store. I liked this. Um, now... Do you guys do a teacher discount for these? Well, the only reason why I'm asking is because it says I teach. What's your superpower? I'm a teacher. Excuse me.
excuse me. Okay, well, that was rude to say. Uh, I'm also a married woman. I'm married. I have five kids, like I said. And I'm an amazing teacher. And I stand firm for what I believe in. And I can teach all my kids the history and the awful business of marshals. Okay. Well, I, I demand a teacher discount for this. Because I am a teacher, I literally grow these children up to work at businesses that aren't this. That actually work at successful businesses, such as... Um, maybe a doctor, or a nurse, or a fireman, or a police officer. Well, I demand, do you have your supervisor, your manager? I really need to speak to them right now, because I am getting hot flashes, and it's, it's not the time. Okay, well, I need to speak to your manager right now. Please, thank you. fine. Listen, you probably would want to go to the famous footwear store down there if you really want good shoes because these shoes are awful. Hi, I am Jessica. People call me Karen. The reasons, I don't know. But I am a teacher and I take care of little kids and I grow them to be something so amazing in this world and I would really appreciate a teacher discount for this. I know it's already cheap, it's already five dollars, but I think it should at least be two. Thank you, thank you for this. See, now that is how you run a store, not what you're doing. Okay. What else? Alright, I wanted this um, mascara because mascara and makeup is my life. If you need a makeup look, I will be happy to do it. Not many people can look like this easily. Clearly you can't. So I am going to ask that um, this can be discounted too because I picked it up and it has a mark on it. I feel like that's disgusting. That's unsanitary. People are using your makeup over there. You might want to go check that out and like clean it up. The makeup, everything's all messed up. The palettes themselves are all broken. They're just... It's, it's literally unsanitary, and with the pandemic and everything going on, I really feel like you should change that. Miss, I'm not wearing a mask because it is my right. I have a right to make other people sick if I want to. It's up to them to wear a mask and to stop them from whatever I'm breathing on them to not make them sick. But for right now, I'm going to stand firm on my rights, and I am not going to wear a mask. So, can you please, um, discount this since it has that mark? Okay, I know there's other mascaras, but I don't want other mascaras. I want this one. This is my famous one, the Voluminous Lash Paradise. I like this one a lot. Sweetie, there's other people waiting in line, and I know, and I'm trying to hurry up, but it's people like this who don't listen. And you're having angry customers over here, and I think you're going to lose business and shut down like every other business that's going through this pandemic. So, I do ask that you get me a, this one. Sir, sir, I, I can handle this myself. Please carry on. I am a, a woman. I have rights. Please go. So, yeah, I am not getting another one. I want this, and I want it discounted. I need to speak to your manager again, because I can't, I... I literally couldn't buy the shoes. I could barely buy the shoes because they were filthy. You wouldn't give me the teacher discount for that sign that really represents who I am as a person. And then you won't give me a discount for this nasty piece of mascara. So let me speak to your manager again because I am fuming. Hi, it's me again. You're, you have a wonderful place, but you're service here it needs to you know needs to fit remember customers are always right and i am having a very hard time i didn't have much caffeine today so i really just want to pack my stuff and go but i am about two seconds away from telling everybody on my blog about this place and everybody on my facebook page that this marshall's is the worst by beyond 
comparison. Okay, I asked, I got this, but in your nasty makeup section, there seems to be marks on everything. Palettes are broken, marks on everything, things are ripped open, people are taking certain makeup. You need a different system to go on in that section because makeup is everything for a woman and I find it very hard to be able to wear makeup that looks like this. So I ask for a discount for this and I am not getting another mascara because this is the one that I use. This is the one that I literally use every single day and I am not gonna get another one from your section. This is the one. This is what I want. Thank you. Even just a dollar off, that's fine. Thank you so much. Thank you. Right. Have a great day. Why can't you be like that? It's really frustrating because I don't know how you got your job here and how you were able to just sell things and deny your customers. It's it's heartbreaking. It's my students are not gonna grow up to be like you. Alright, so I got this too. Um the North Face. Now North Face in general, I looked online, I researched everything before I went to go purchase this. You guys are selling it for like a dollar more than what it is online. And I would want it to be the way it is online. Okay. Yeah. Um, so online it was third it was forty dollars uh no. Online it was was $39.99 here you guys have it for $40 so you guys have it probably like a cent more but I want it to be $39.99 it doesn't even include shipping online sweetie thank you see that is how you run a business okay and I just have a few more things and then we can just sell things out miss miss I am literally still trying to buy things and I don't know why you're attacking me but you can literally go to Walmart down there I'm sure they have stuff your size this is probably not the place for you considering what you're wearing bye sweetie okay um let's see I would like this too I mean it's not me it's for my daughter but she's into that like punk rock phase so um, these are really cute. Now, your the button, I don't like how it's not just plain black. It doesn't fit with the rest of the style. Okay, okay, listen. I know you don't create the clothes and you don't do certain things, but listen, sweetie, I am a mom of three daughters and the other two are boys and when my daughters want to wear something to school and want to feel confident I want to make sure that what they wear is what they want and to have a button that has a little bit of brown and black and doesn't match the rest of the outfit is horrendous so I do ask that maybe you can um like I don't know if you have a sharpie or something like that or something to, or different buttons that you can sew into this pants I'm not asking for much, sweetie. I really am not. Trust me, I'm a teacher. I know what's a lot. Just a little bit of the button. I'm not trying to get close to you. I know I'm not wearing a mask and I cannot be six feet away because I feel like I'm yelling and my throat is just hurting today. So I am not gonna yell at you. I just want you to know that I'm not dealing with this going on i'm trying to tell you that this button does not match the rest of this outfit it's got a little bit of brown and there's no brown anywhere near these pants thank you i can tell you right now my daughter is not gonna work here and none of my daughters and my kids is gonna work here I must deal with a lot of crazy people too huh Yep, that looks good. Thank you so much. And this one was already cheap enough, so don't worry about a discount. Unless, and except the 80%, which is going to be for everything. Oh, we'll still talk about the 80% discount. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. We're still going to talk about it. Alright. 
next thing I have is these shoes. These are super cute. I just got my nails done and I was able to get like it free because I was talking to them so many times about how their nail, like gel nails are disgusting because you're literally dipping your finger in that same powder that everybody else is dipping in. And I complained. I talked to their manager. I called corporate. I told them that it was ridiculous and I'm not going to deal with that anymore. So they gave my nails for free. It's all about business, sweetie. I, I just find business not the same anymore and people are just so rude. They don't have any like consideration for anybody. So yeah, I like these a lot. I feel like our feet need to be free, especially in this hot weather. Oh my goodness. So, um, these came out to over there. I don't know if it was the wrong sign, but it was like 30, 35 99 And I can get these at Walmart for like eight bucks. So, if you guys really want to have more, you know, customers and more people going into your business, you might want to put these down lower. So maybe like, so could you like bring these down to eight? I won't have these part of the 80% because that would be ridiculous. I have everything for free. But could you bring these down to eight? I am not trying to get everything I get for a discount. Miss. You need to stop. You're breathing on me and I'm going to get sick. I work with children. Put a mask back on. I don't need to wear a mask. I am a free woman. I have rights. Listen, as long as you have your mask on, you won't get sick. This pandemic is making everybody crazy. So yeah, $8. Like I said, I'm not trying to get everything for a discount. I think it's important that you guys sell stuff for equal amount, but you have like better like, they're better like versions. And $8 for this would be amazing. You'd sell so much. No, you're not going to do it. Fine. Then you just lost these and I'm not going to, I'm not even going to buy them. I literally don't need your your ignorance right now because I I have so much to do today and I, I can't like this morning was already enough. I woke up at eight o'clock, had my coffee, relaxed with my husband, played with my kids, and it was just so stressful because I wanted to make sure everybody had time with me because I'm so important in their lives. just very stressful for me to deal with that stuff and I'm trying to balance my family I'm trying to balance my work with the kids I mean I only work three hours a day because I, I cover lunches and everything and I you know I sub sometimes so that will be my eight hours but it's just it's a lot of work and I'm trying to take it all together and relax I have two more things so if we can hurry it up then I can get home and leave I know you guys are all excited like I said you have like a few more minutes relax there's like plenty other like where's your other like your other workers why aren't they getting them oh because the pandemic they left well this is what happens when businesses don't know what they're doing they lose people i'm not surprised all right so um this one too um eight bucks but when it was hang hung up it was inside out and I think that's just some professional, so I, I do ask that you give me $2 off at least because when I'm trying to shop and if I didn't know that the tag was out, I would have put it on inside out and I would have looked like a fool. So $2 off the $8 was $6. Why are you fighting with me on this? I, I come here every single Friday and you've dealt with me. You know what I do. You know what I want. And I want this to be $2 off because I... Do not need to be shopping through things and find out that your clothes are not um, carefully put on the shelves or not you know taken with care because my closet if you saw my closet it's a walk-in closet and it has everything put neatly my shoes my clothes um, my dresses my shirts by everything that is how this place should run not 
oh let me just throw this on a hook and put it up that's not what i want i want something that's you know professionally put on a hook thank you six dollars it is that's all i ask it's not that hard all right oh, i actually have two more things i know you guys still have really cute stuff i have to be honest with it all right and i like this this is a really cute turtleneck now i have an issue it is only a small but i'm a medium so do you guys have this in any other size no I'm trying not to cry. This is the issue with the world today. You guys only carry things that are small, extra small, but don't carry things that bigger woman like myself and like the girl behind me have. We want to look beautiful too, and if you guys cannot carry all sizes, then you guys shouldn't be open. You guys literally should not be opened. It is heartbreaking as a mother to see that you guys cannot carry all sizes in the same type of clothing. I don't even want to buy this anymore because if I can't look good, no one can look good. That's all I have to say. emotional today did not take my medication this morning and I'm just a mess so and you might want to talk to your manager about the way this establishment is being run because it is awful and it is heartbreaking as a woman to see that people cannot wear the same thing because of their size it's it's so aggravating I have bought bikinis in a bigger size because I wanted to feel what other people have felt who are bigger sizes than me. Um, no, I did not buy them so no one else could buy them. I mean, I bought the last extra large the other day and I felt, you know, I felt bad, but I wanted to feel how everybody else feels in bikinis and it's not right. It's, it's stressful for a woman. Plus, your mirrors add 10 pounds to us, definitely, because I do not look like that in certain clothes when I try them on. Oh, speaking of try-on, why don't you guys allow us to try on shoes and clothes? Alright, well, the pandemic is stopping people from trying to purchase your stuff. I wouldn't just buy clothes and be like, oh, this looks like it will be good. And then I try it on at home and it doesn't look like this. Listen, I I cannot fathom why you guys do what you do. With the pandemic, I feel like everybody's fearing so much and you guys don't understand that. Maybe you guys shouldn't even open if you're gonna not allow us to try on clothes because trying on clothes allows us to know it looks good on us and then we can go. your reasoning is invalid it's invalid and i don't want to hear it i don't i think you guys need to figure out your own establishment and figure out how to run a place before you even open this back up not to mention you're still selling stuff that's from spring and it's now summer i know you just opened back up but you need to hurry up you need to you should have had all this stuff in the system before you open back up so last thing I want is these leggings. Now they, I have no complaints about them. The only thing is there is a little tiny rip. Do you see it? It's somewhere over here. There is a rip. There, I saw a rip. And I just ask that it can be free because um, I am, I can sew it myself, but I think it needs to be free because I am not buying something that's not how it's supposed to look okay thank you yeah i just like i said i just want it free i just want to be able to wear something and not worry about it yes you can talk to your manager and if he doesn't listen then i'm gonna talk to him oh man 
The line got down really, really quick. Did they leave? <gasps> Listen, patience is not a key thing for humans nowadays. People don't, don't have patience. I mean, you guys have been waiting for what, like 30 minutes? Like, relax. Okay, thank you. So, um, I said I found a rip. I can't locate it right now because I'm, I'm just, it's too hot in here and I want to get out. Um, but there was a rip somewhere in here and I can't find it. But I just ask because of the clothing, it needs to be free because if you rip, if something's ripped, well, it's not worth the price that it was at. And this was already like $8. So I might as well just make it free. Um, I am not complaining a lot today. The fact that you are coming at me and making me feel like I am a complainer or somebody that just doesn't, you know, buy stuff and walk out and, like, think, be thankful for what you guys do, uh, considering you are working in a pandemic, it's just ridiculous. I, I found a rip in these pants that wasn't from me, that was from someone who, you know, whether it be shipping or whether it be you guys putting on hangers, because you don't know how to put on hangers, um... I personally don't think that I should be paying $8 for pants that are ripped. Plus, these aren't going to be for me. They're going to be for my daughter. So, I'm going to have my daughter walking around school with ripped pants. And to the point where, you know, she might feel uncomfortable or get bullied. And then I have to go to the principal and I have to talk to him about bullying and how it's inconsiderate. And that the rip in her behind area or her crotchal region is there. And they're gonna complain to me because my daughter's getting bullied but i'm gonna say no she shouldn't be bullied no one should be looking there anyway so free no okay well that's three things that you lost that i couldn't purchase because you guys didn't want to listen so with everything buying i bought the pants bought these pants these the north face um this the teacher, which I got the teacher discount. Beautiful, beautiful. And these nasty shoes, but I can just go to my book club with them. Um, okay, so now with all of those, um, there should be the 80% discount. And your manager is right next to you, so I can confirm. There was a flyer the other day that I looked in and I read it, and it said 80% off your entire store. No, it, it was a brand new flyer. It was not the flyer before the pandemic because you guys thought you were going to shut down. It was literally now. Like, I I know that you guys are having the 80% off discount. And I, I, as a woman and as a customer, I deserve the 80% discount considering that I saw it. I don't need proof. I read it with my own eyes. I wouldn't just say something. I'm sure it's in your system. You can go typing away and go look at it. But I, I promise you. Let me ask your other customers. You guys saw the 80% discount, right? They must not be part of the membership. I get um, personal emails from a site that I ended up signing up for, and they gave it to me, and it was all set up and done, and it was. It told me that there was discounts and stuff. I even went to Target down the street too, and they didn't. It took them a little bit, but then they gave me my 50% uh, discount off their candles. Okay, if you cannot give me my 80% discount, then I'm literally just going to leave and I'm not going to buy anything. And then you will lose money throughout your day and your business will shut down. <sighs> okay, well, fun. You can take this, your nasty shoes, your gross mascara, the North Face, which I actually really loved, and... It's breaking my heart that I can't buy it, but I don't want to deal, do business with you guys. This too, this nasty dress that was inside out on the hanger, gross. And these with, I mean, I'm thankful for the button, but somebody else can cherish that. Maybe they'll get an 80% discount because I am done with this place. Please, in a few days, you will get a call from my lawyer. You will get a call from myself complaining. Um, also, if you go online on Google, Google, I will also be having a little, um, 
review for you guys that is not so pleasant so other people don't have to deal with the harassment that I felt today. And also, if you do go online, there's also a great little site that you can go on and see reviews as well. The site, I can't think of the name right now. Yelp. That was it. Yelp. I will be writing a review on there and everybody goes on there. As well as talking to my Facebook friends, my Instagram friends, um, Snapchatting this place. I'll be taking a picture of the front of your place later as well. Um, I will also be um, doing stuff on my blog and writing a whole little thing about it and as well all the parents that come into my school on Monday I will let them know to not go to this place because you guys need to shut down and not harass and hurt all your customers who are here to take all their money and give it to you just to buy stuff. So, I hope you have a great day. I don't want to hear anything. I don't want to hear any ifs or buts. I am very, very, very hurt today, and I, I'm, I'm just about fed up. So, have a great day, and um, I hope you find another job.